Okay, welcome back and thanks for joining me for this new video. Um, yeah, yesterday was a, a kind of a difficult day. We had a southeasterly wind, uh, fairly gusty at times, and uh, it made um, the presentation of the boat and, and the fly, of course, very difficult. I was drifting way too fast, even with a, a large drift sock. I should have used two drift sock maybe to, to slow down a little bit more. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have a fancy Minn Kota uh, outboard, so uh, I can't really anchor myself or slow down the drift, but the drift sock was, was uh, a little bit uh, overwhelmed yesterday. Uh, the pike were sitting fairly low. Uh, we had a, a very, not a very, but a fairly cold week for this time of the year. Last week we even had a little bit of ground frost, and I think it pushed some of the pike a little bit deeper. Uh, yesterday they were willing to come up to, to grab the, the flies but you had to present them fairly close uh, to them uh, they were sitting on the bottom quite a few fish uh, nearly all the fish had uh, some lice on them showing that they've been sitting on the silt for quite a few days now uh, but they were fairly active once you found them. Uh, I struggled in the morning. I was, I think, up to about lunchtime. I still had no fish to the boat. Uh, the area that I wanted to, I thought fish would be showing, uh, well, they were not hidden for some reason. So I moved and I found a place not even deeper, about the same depth. I was getting there but about between five to six meters. Seemed to be nice. Um, fishing a sink six line and uh, tr yeah stripping fairly slowly uh, but funny enough they were not taking in the deep they were kind of coming up to the boat and they were taking about two three meters underneath the boat so that was 
most of the action yesterday. Uh, I can't complain. I finished with about 12, 12 fish and uh, some nice 80s, 80, maybe 80 plus uh, fish. They're looking very good at the moment. Um, they are a big healthy belly on them, so they've been obviously feeding before that uh, cold snap last week. Now we're having a different kind of a week, uh, as usual here. The weather changes like crazy. So uh, less wind today, uh, more sunshine, which I don't really like. Uh, I'd rather have a bit of a wave when it's bright, like yesterday. That's why I went out yesterday. I could have went today, but uh, usually flat calm and sunny conditions is not great. So I opted for more waves to break up that, that light on the water and uh, get the pike feeding. And um, that was it. Fairly simple day. I tried different flies in the morning and then I found uh, one fly that really got them moving. It was a simple um, flasher with a lot of flash, this one, white head. And I had a mixture of silver, purple and blue flash on the tail. And they seemed to really like it. I caught all the fish on that fly. Uh, the fish that were taking were taking fairly well, like... Uh, the fly there was no lip hook fish they all hooked uh, fairly deep uh, so they were taking it fairly aggressively and uh, that was it very simple day uh, straight to the point it was it was good i enjoyed it uh, and yes uh, as you saw uh, it was a rod that i caught <laughs> it's uh yeah gave me a good fight i felt um something when i was dragging the bottom and uh, i hooked it and by lifting it off the of the mud, I think it felt uh, like a heavy weight, but that was moving. And then within a few seconds, I knew there was something wrong. I thought it was a big branch or something, but uh, hey, I got a nice free rod. Uh, pity I don't use that much these rods anymore, but uh, oh well, I'm sure somebody will find use for it. So thanks for watching again, guys. Uh, thank you very much for all the members. Much appreciated, uh, especially now that my computer is on the brink of extinction uh, i managed to revive it this morning i thought there was be there there, there were going to be no more um, videos or live streams but uh, the the old mac uh, came back to life and uh, i was able to edit that video so again thank you for the donation and uh, as usual all the money goes towards the the channel and getting new gear so that's another thing that uh, i have to put on my shopping list so never ending but thank you very much, guys. Much appreciated as usual. And hope you have a good time and uh, get fishing soon. Thank you and goodbye.